here in Bilbo with us here in the John Mandola Show uh, Pitson area. Uh, let's talk about your squad this year. Uh, give us give us a couple names that, that are doing the job, whether it's offensively or defensively. And I know it, this team is deep. Mm -hmm. You might give us 20 names, but uh, give us give us a handful that you see working hard this year and, and producing on the field. Well, yeah, well, with our pitching staff, we got a new Elijah Barr. It's his first year. He's a freshman. He's been he's been great for us. I mean, just strikes every like every time. You got Nick Cherisaro. He's been there before. He's a senior. He, he knows how, he knows how to pitch in big games. Anthony Sinsetti, He's another senior. You know what you're going to get out of him. He's consistent. And then you look on the like an offense. You got Drew DeLuca. Great hitter for us, always on base. Jeremy Colley, and he's, a machine. he's always on base. Troy Davis, power hit, he could drive the ball. And then Anthony Ornelli, he didn't really play a lot last year, but he's come and been big for us this year. You like sports, uh, you've been around sports, so talk about you know all the different sports you play and your favorites and mm -hmm. you know. I play football in the fall, you know, I like that a lot. We had a great year last year with Coach Barberi, who won the Wyoming Valley Conference for the first time in a long time. Then basketball with Coach Semenza, you know, great coach. He really knows how to run a program. We won the district last year, you know, came up a little short this year. And then baseball with Coach Zafudo, I mean, it's a blast. Like, just being there every day, it's a great time. You guys are always well outfitted uh, mm -hmm. at Pittston <laughs> yeah. area. And, of course, we're talking a little bit about the booster club, the community. Talk about, you know, 10, 20 years from now, you're going to be one of those people. Maybe you'll, maybe you'll live in Pittston, maybe you'll live yeah. in Virginia Beach, but you find yourself to be one of those people that will support this program uh, like the parents in the community do? Yeah, no, I, I love it here. I, I, I want to live here forever. I love Pittston. You know, I, I, I'll support this program forever. I love what Coach Fudo does. Just he, he makes every day just such a blast for us. And that's refreshing to hear because mm -hmm. a lot of times we hear adults in our area like, hey, get out of here, yeah. go somewhere else. But mm -hmm. for you, you have a lot of pride. Talk uh -huh. a little bit about where that pride comes from. Is it family as well that you know uh your roots there in Pittston yeah you know my dad he played football for Pittston with coach Barberi so that that's what kind of got me into football there and you know my mom went to Seton so hey, it's know, in that, town yeah that's <laughs> Gonzo but you know she played basketball so I think that that's where I get the love for basketball from, from my mom how about as far as your, your baseball game like things that you're working on you know what would you say you know better at hitting this year, better defense? Like, are you just trying to always constantly work on yeah. when you're in that season? And then, you know, when it's the off season, you might have to work at all the sports. Yeah, it's tough with, you know, I don't get a lot of time for bait because, you know, summer hits and you're just football, football, football. But, you know, baseball, I'm, I'm just trying to work on my craft on the mound, just get more consistent, you know, work on other pitches, but we're getting there. When coach Richards is the pitching coach. He's phenomenal with us. He does great. The league, there's some talented teams. I mean, you know, you got, high top and then you got some of that a little bit of the middle but mm -hmm. let's talk about some of the competition you faced this year and you know there's no gimmies no, uh no, not at all and uh you know a team like dallas is talented they could beat you you know we know what hazelton's about mm -hmm. and, you know some other teams will give you their best shot but uh you enjoy going you know when you go i'm sure you're you're getting a rise up crowd when you're on the road yeah. and when you're home you're getting a, a lot of good mm -hmm. home cooking there yeah you know you'd rather play great competition than play someone below because Great competition is going to make you better down the road for when we get into this, the district playoffs and if we're fortunate to get into the state playoffs. That experience, it's, it's just going to help you so much more down the road where if you're playing a team lesser than you, that's not going to help you really. All right. Well, hey, it's uh, good to hear your story. You already sound like you, you know what you're doing. You're the mayor there at Pitts. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Keep it up. All right.